Hey guys, welcome back. And oh, oh, cool. no, I don't know why I'm on. Direct from the transistor radio in your lap. Stone. Alright, so I just wanted to show you this uh, useful feature on Google Chrome that you may never have heard of. I actually had never heard of it until about a year ago when um, an, uh, a friend of mine showed me it called Inspect Elements or Developer Tool. You may not buy it either. Uh, Control Shift I or yeah, Developer Tools. When it comes up, um, it looks it won't look like that by the way um, it'll be on this elements tab and it'll look like this probably very um, technical based but it really isn't you can use this and the reason why it's mainly it's useful is you can go like this and let's get rid of that and ooh, uh, let's Oh, here you go. Yeah, right there. And it'll appear with things like this. And you can change text on page. You can change it to hello. And it's just really useful. Now, that says hello. I can change images. I can get rid of images. I don't like the Google symbol. Let's get rid of Google or something like that. I don't know. If you want to put your own logo on the Google page. I don't know why you'd want to do that, but you can do that. Now it just says Google, but uh, that doesn't look very nice. If I can find, oh, here we go, title Google. So we'll change the title to nothing. That should fix it. No, it did not. What did I do wrong? Oh, here, alt. There you go. All right, it's all gone. We can maybe even get rid of other stuff. That's just one feature. The The pictures. You can also re replace the picture because that's just a hyperlink that links to another page. Um, it's just got a lot of features. Um, what else? You could uh, make this into an iPhone 6 or... And this is just kind of simulating. So it's kind of useful for sizing things, seeing how stuff would fit. Uh, let's see. The only issue is you can't close this, so you gotta go here and you gotta pop it out. This and boom, and you can just make this go 125. That fit better. I just refresh this page because it does edits, and now it's kind of as if I was on the, the mobile device. So let's do that. Oh, once again, my URL. That's so weird. Well. I don't think Google's ever asked me for before. Um, but kind of useful. Well, not kind of. It really is useful. Look at this. I can even see that's what it would look like. That. If I was Herbal M, a tablet. It's very useful. And you can just kind of go through, tap that, and see it's like this circular thing. It's because it thinks uh, it's making uh, the web page think I'm on, a, on like a an iPhone or something or a phone that kind of thing um now I can uh you can even capture a screenshot within this mode uh you can add devices add device pixel ratio just really really good uh mode it, it starts off like this uh, originally now let's see if this back we can flick it back in by clicking this and yeah and then we can just get off of this mode oh, turn that off adds back to normal and it's really good um really good for pranks so if i was to search google on google kind of stupid and i went I, oh, that. Or, I don't want to click the one. Hi. Good. Yeah. Blue. And then if I click that, it shows me. This is where it's kind of more useful. Uh, 
will show me the link that it's going to be sending me to. So this is kind of useful um, for words that are hyperlinked. Normally, the only use for this is kind of in 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 the Google search engine or Bing or something like that. But you know, you're not going to some random. I can change it here by saying by clicking on this, changing it high, change it to high up here. You can see that. I could probably change description of the website like here. It's just it's kind of useful maybe for pranks or uh, you don't like the what the HTML on a website looks like. Want to edit it? Kind of useful. Ooh. That's all right. Yeah. We can change that to low. Um, it's me, and then it does that. It's still got all this stuff right here, but I don't want to format it because I'm a lazy person. Um, I can get rid of the sign-in symbol. You can just do so much with this, and it's not very um, advertised feature. You probably have never heard of this, and. It's just kind of cool. You can mess around with your friends with it. Um, I don't know what, what else you would use it for. It allows you to do snapshots within uh, Google. It's just really cool. And if you've forgotten how to get to it, it's just this button up here, more tools and developer tools. So thanks for watching. I hope this is really useful. Uh, I find it useful. I like messing around on it and creating cool looking web pages that say cool stuff. I had, there was an article that said, um, it was an article on how gaming was good for, for teenagers or something like that. And I changed it entirely, and it, but it did have some down points in it. And I got rid of all the down points and made them up points kind of inside this article and then sent it to my friend who read it and, and kind of laughed at the article. And then I told him, oh, it's, it's, it. I edited it. And he's like, oh, that's cool. So it's kind of a little cool feature. Could be useful. Um, so, yeah. So if this helped you out, please subscribe and like. And I will see you in another video. Bye. Direct from the transistor radio in your loud Stone.